Hey, what up travel crew? It is your elite cruise counselor Mandy here with you to do a weekend cruise news update. Are you ready? Let's go. So what's going on? Well, major announcements out of Florida that could have you sailing yet in 2020, plus a look at when all major brands plan to resume operations. And without a single ship in port in the entire 2020 season, Alaska says they've been hit hardest by the pause in operations. Here's what they say they need to stay alive in 2021. And stranded in a foreign land. It's not Gilligan's Island. It's cruising during a worldwide pandemic. And it's happened again. Here's how to keep it from happening to you. It feels like it's taken forever, but the CDC no-sale order is set to expire in just one week, and Carnival Corporation seeks to be the first ship sailing still in 2020. This week, a U.S. District Appeals Court judge amended a previous ruling that required 60 days notice for any Carnival Corporation ship to enter U.S. waters. Now, this ruling had nothing to do with the CDC no-sale order. It was part of a previous sanction issued against Princess Cruise Lines, which is a Carnival Corporation line, in 2016 for illegal dumping. But it would have made a return to sailing nearly impossible in 2020. But that mandate has been amended to just 30 days notice, which means cruising out of Florida in December with Carnival Corporation could indeed still happen. As for everybody else, Royal Caribbean looks to bounce back in early December with their first launch from Singapore. Meanwhile, Princess, Hall & America Line, and Celebrity are all seeking to return to service in mid-December. Norwegian Cruise Line, however, they're saying not so fast. They say they need at least 60 days to relaunch operation once the CDC no-sale order is officially lifted. That means 2020 sailings with Norwegian Cruise Lines, pretty unlikely. Not going to happen. Okay, so Alaskan cities that rely heavily on cruise traffic, they didn't see a single ship in 2020, and they say that has to change for 2021. Canada closing their borders and waters to Americans and cruise ships, it effectively canceled the entire Alaska 2020 season. For many small seabird towns and port cities, that meant the loss of 70% of their annual revenue. That has to hurt. 2021 doesn't look much better. Even though Americans are trying to travel domestically and Alaska should be a hot market, there's a piece of 100-year-old legislation that could stop them. You see, the law says all Alaska-bound vessels must stop in Canada. And while many vessels take care of this by starting or ending their voyage in Vancouver, with Canada showing no signs of easing their strict border and marine closures, the entire season could again be lost. Now, Alaska Representative Don Young is working on new legislation that could change the old one or at least allow for a variance during the pandemic so that ships can call on Alaska and save jobs in the region and potential income. Now, you guys know I love Alaska more than almost anything. So of course, I'm gonna be keeping a close eye on it for the 2021 season. But don't forget, I'm taking a huge group of guests with me to Alaska in 2022, when hopefully things have returned to normal. I'd love to have you with me, shoot me an email, like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll get you all the information you need. Now, our last story, and this one, it's happened again, guys. If you've been watching the headlines, you're seeing people getting kicked off cruise ships with nowhere to go. Don't worry, this won't happen to you unless you don't follow the rules. It goes to what I've been telling you. They cannot mess around when it comes to the relaunch of operations. They have to get it right the first time. That means as long as you stay with your cruise group, keep your mask on, maintain social distancing, you're always going to be allowed back on the ship. But if you wander off for a beer like these folks have done, or if you think you can sneak away and it won't be noticed, you're wrong. You won't be allowed back on the ship. They are not messing around. You are not the exception. Please don't think you are. Cruising will be safer than ever. It will be bad and I want you on board that ship. Let me help get you there. Like, subscribe, comment, get in touch with me. I'll answer your emails and I can't wait to help you go somewhere awesome. Thanks for joining me this morning and have a great rest of your weekend. Bye.